All right, uh, so this is what we have left in the previous part, and uh, this bottle is the final uh, render of what we have made in the previous part. As I have mentioned, there is uh, some or a lot of things that we will fix. We will fix the glass bottle, and we will fix the lighting and add HDRI. So uh, let's uh, get started uh, by uh, going to the H, uh, uh, world part and we will add environmental texture and we will open uh, to add our HDRI alright uh, so this is, is, this is what we will get uh, using the HDRI so there is a lot of reflections inside the glass of course and uh, you should see some reflections for the lid and if we hit uh, if we hide the lighting you will uh, see something and I want to remove uh, move all the lights to uh, the lighting and you will see a lot of changes and as you can see uh, there is a lot of changes for the glass and uh, let's go to the shader or the shader editor I, and I want to uh, try to use the glass of course we are here I will uh, select that and I want uh, to uh, choose the glass to test something and uh, I will remove the volume for, for a moment and uh, copy this color and list here and uh, roughness may be uh, 0.02 and after that I will uh, make some another test uh, so this test will be um, sampling uh, this is what we want of course uh, so the sampling will be uh, all right uh, so sampling uh, will be for now uh, we can go for 200 and uh, I want to Increase this roughness to be 0.04 for example and I will test for a moment so this is the test and it's now rendering and I will pause the video until it's finished uh, the test uh, so I think uh, we are close for the final uh, and uh, we want to make something here uh, we want to add the label and we can also add the water so let's see how we can achieve that uh, for example we will go here and for in the solid uh, mode we will hide all other layers and uh, let's uh, go here and I will add two layers uh, two loop cuts and scale in the Z axis such as this uh, then I will select some faces these are the faces that I will select these are the faces and we can select also this one and this one of course if you want to make the label all around uh, it's a matter of choice but I will select only these vertices and I will sh shift D to duplicate and separate these selections So I will hide, of course, this object, and we don't want the solidify. So I will delete the solidify and the subdivision, and select all and UV to unwrap. Uh, then I think we didn't activate the screencast case, and uh, we will go for the UV image editor, and this is the image that we have, or the UV editor. So uh, we will rotate, and uh, we have this one. So I will scale and uh, we can uh, make an image. This image uh, will be double the side on all axes in X and Y. And then I will uh, make a new image and then export this image from UV to export UV layout. Uh, we can make here another uh, UVs uh, a folder. And after that, we will say it label export. And I will select this one and make it uh, much thicker to uh, see uh, when we uh, import in Adobe Photoshop. 
All right, uh, so uh, we have uh, opened here the BN image file and you should ensure that you have already exported it as BNG. Uh, so uh, we have this to, I should rename it file edits. 